Hey guys, what's up? We're, welcome back to my next video. Um, as you can see, we're doing another review, uh, but this time it's going to be on the Miss Seattle Hydroplane Boat. Um, I've used it before, and wait, something's wrong over right here. I'm going to cut this out, obviously. Let's just restart. Hey guys, what's up? Um, today you can probably tell already we're doing another review. Um, it's on the Miss Seattle hydroplane boat. I've already used it before. That's why it's not an unboxing. And um, yeah, we have some a few videos of us using it. Um, and I'm just gonna show you a little about it, how it works, some good things, some bad things, a lot of good things though. It's a good beginning boat. Okay. So, let's get into it. Okay, I'm going to show you a little bit about the boat, and then I'm going to, uh, like, show you all the parts and pieces that come with it. And then I'm going to, like, talk about all the pros and cons about it. So, yeah, let's get into it. Um, so, it, first, there's, like, there's remote control, the radio. Um, it's not very basic, actually. It has... All these knobs on the sides that you can use. One, two, three. Um, reverse. Uh, forward. Um, throttle, steering, power. And then on this side, we have some knobs. And that's to right along here. And that's to adjust the throttle, steering, trim. Stuff like that. And then we have the tr trigger right here, forward, backwards, actually, but you have to use the little side pieces to go in reverse. So if you go, if you go like this, when you're driving the boat, it won't actually go in reverse. And yeah, but if you pull the throttle, it'll go forward. And, but, and then if you switch into reverse, if you pull the throttle, it'll, it'll go backwards. And then we have the steering, just basic steering for most stuff. Um, it actually does not come with any batteries. So we had to put in some batteries. And so let's get into the boat part after I shut this. There we go. Okay, so in the boat, at first, it comes with a clip, normal clip, take off the front part, slide it over, pretty basic, just a piece of plastic with some styrofoam inside of it, some decals on the top and the sides. Um, so then, actually a good tip for this is when you are um, like doing your boat and stuff, don't just leave the clip hanging around, put it back inside the slot right here so you don't lose it and then there's another protection piece for so that you can put the tape along the sides so it has ultimate waterproofing and a little little piece right here so that it holds on the this and then here let's move that out of the way so yeah if you take off this you get into the internals so you get the motor here as you can tell i took out the tubing right here to clean it out it's another good thing to do you just clean out the tubes and everything because on the side right here um it inject it takes in water and then it it from this tube it goes inside from here it goes in the tube in in around the motor and it comes out this tube in out the side right here. So then we got this little, um, it just keeps you straight. You only turn one way sort of thing. You got the props, the rudder. Um, another thing that I learned about this is never touch the rudder. Like, like, like you can touch it like this, but just never like mess with it. And then the prop, it just normal spin, 
like that. Um, it comes down from the tube. Um, on the bottom, there's just some screws, and it's just a nice, nice flat surface. And then you got this adjustable flap right here. So as you can see, there's a little tiny, a little tiny screw right here. So you can adjust the angle of this. And more about the internals. You got the plug-in where you put the battery. I switched out the Velcro because I don't like it. And then you got the ser the um the receiver right here. A servo. That's one thing that I broke. I had to replace that. And then you got the the speed um speed control. And then the, back here you just got some nice decals. Pretty basic boat. It doesn't cost very much. Um, it's a good. It's a good beginner boat. And yeah, I, I love the detail, the decals. And um, just yeah, I hear some videos of here's some um recordings of how we drove the boat. Hope you enjoy.